Hi, my dear viewers, my clients. Um, here I am in Shanghai city, the most beautiful city in China. And with this beautiful lady, her <laughs> name is you. Sarah, mm. the sales manager of an amazing company, top selling in crushers. Sarah, please help me. What else? Yeah, warmly welcome to Zenith Crusher Group. And Zenith. today is my great honor to be here and give you a brief introduction about our company. So here we go. This Let's is go. our exhibition hall. Okay, warmly welcome. And uh, in front of you, this is uh, China, the biggest uh, exhibition hall among all of the Crusher competitors. And uh, this is 18 meters high and it covers area of 15,000 square meters. These flags representing we already sold 180 countries all over the world. Imagine 180 countries, they have partners, they sold their product. Yes. I want to show you, I want to show you their products, how big they are, huge projects. Sarah will be of course speaking of them, my dear viewers. You, uh, if you are in this business, of course, you will understand what we are talking about. If not, don't worry, you can text me. I will patiently uh, answer all your questions. Yeah. So let's go to this huge one. What is this, sir? What is this called? Uh -huh. This one in the middle one is territory crusher. It is normally used for the big mines, just like a gold mine, copper ore mine, or even the iron ore mine. And this allows a bigger feeding size to be one meter feeding. One meter one feeding, meter can you feeding imagine? Directly. It yeah. can be a huge rock, right? Like one meter rock directly, and then it starts crushing process, making it smaller and smaller. And uh, the, this gyrator crusher, the dumper, can go, go, go directly dump directly the big rocks into this gyrator crusher. No need a vibrating feeder. No need vibrating. Okay. And uh, on the left side, it's similar with metal type, multiple cylinder hydraulic cone crusher. And on the right side, this is Sandwick type, uh, similar to Sandwick. So metal and Sandwick, my dear viewers, you have to understand that metal and Sandwick, they are really re leaders in, in wo worldwide there by, with their quality. So these are those types, metal and Sandwick types. Sarah, and, what else can we see here? Okay, and we can go this way. You can see the vibrating feeder and drop crusher, impact crusher, cone crusher, and wow. vibrating screens. Okay, so this is called a vibrating feeder, right? Vibrating feeder is just like when you're eating, you need a spoon or a fork, mm. right, to feed into your mouth. I, I, I really, <laughs> I really feel that the, the metal, the metal is really, really uh, thick. I, so I, I feel the yes. quality, by the way. Exactly. We choose the best steel, Bao Steel, B-A-O Steel, number one in China. B-A-O, Bao Steel, Bao Gan. B-A-O, good, Bao yeah. Gan. And these are all hard dogs. And uh, you can see the hard dog steel can uh, get more uh, favor from our foreign customers because they like hard dogs to be more real resi resistance. Got it. <clears throat> What is this? What is and this, this huge equipment? This is a jaw crusher. Jaw crusher. Pay jaw, attention yeah. to this SKF. What is that SKF? SKF is a one bearing type, one bearing brand. Okay. It's imported from Europe. From Europe. I, Original. I think the best. The yeah, best. the best the in best. the world. And this jaw crusher is just like your mouth. After the feeder feed into your mouth, and then you can crush, crush the big rocks tuning, 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 and go into the second uh, ray crusher, that is impact crusher or cone crusher. Here is impact yeah. crusher. I see two impact crushers. I bet this one is a bit uh, like bigger one. The size of this first one is bigger. That one is a smaller one. Yeah, this one actually one set even can reach to 500 tons per hour. 500 tons per hour, amazing. That's, yeah. that's really amazing. That one is, I bet, 250 yeah, yeah, 250, Half the size. yeah, it's smaller, you can see from the size. Wow, that's correct, that's great, insane. You, yeah. And what is this? I don't know what uh, is this. This is a vibrating screen. After primary crusher by jaw crusher comes to the impact crusher or cone crusher, then comes to the vibrating screen to separate the output sizes into different aggregate sizes like uh, 0 to 5 mm, 5 to 10, 10 to 20 mm, which is suitable for the aggregate uh, construction for the concrete or asphalt. Wow, your explanation is so, so perfect. <laughs> Thank you. A different mesh, different sizes, adjustable by the 
a bigger hole or a smaller hole, the mesh size. By the way, when you, my dear customers, when you want to uh, come here, Sarah welcomes you. They will also show you 3D presentation. Exactly. Uh, on their screen for every models they produce. And also pay attention to the size of their, this is the, just the showroom. This is just the showroom. Can you imagine the size of the factory? The factory is itself, you see, on those posters. You yeah, see, Mr. these Simon posters yeah. to shoot. So these, yeah. these are their huge factories. And by the way, they have factories in, in three Six. or four cities, I bet. Ling in uh, Jiangsu province, in Henan province. Yeah. This one is in Shanghai, this, this huge Lingang one. Lingang area. Uh, yeah. le nearby, it is Tesla. Tesla. Nearby Tesla, wow. Excellent. Elon Musk, Tesla. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome Hi, Elon you Musk, to Mr. our... Mr. Musk, hello. <laughs> <laughs> we, we're mentioning your name in the video, yeah. so our video will be booming. Oh, oh really? <laughs> Just put Elon Musk okay, and that's Elon it. Elon Musk, okay. And, and here this is, is the VSI to making the sand or reshipping to cubicle ship. Oh, mm. sand making. What yeah. is this called? What well, is this? VSI. VSI, yeah. V V VCI or VSI? VSI, Vertical Shaft Impact ah, Pressure, the first letter. You are a specialist mm. on that, anyway. <laughs> okay. And here is their presentation. Mm -hmm. This is a 3D view to help our customer get a better idea how it's assembled and how it's working. This is only crusher section. We do have grinding mills for the powder making on another side. Okay, so those are, those stuff are, these are grind, grinding... Uh, grinding mill for the powder making. Powder. You know, these are crushers crush into the aggregate sizes like a 20 millimeter below or 25 millimeter below for the asphalt or concrete. And those are for the grinding meal into the powder making like five to 45 micron for the paper making, chemical, plaster or lady makeup, PVC, lots of uh, industries actually. Normally to grinding the limestone, castle cabinet, marble, like this, into the powder. Even yesterday, we have Bangladesh customer. They uh, already bought from us two times, twice. Okay. And this time is coming for the third order. They are grinding the limestone into the chicken feed. Chicken feed. <laughs> yeah, feed is a chicken. Got it. Got yeah. it. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, my dear viewers here, uh, you you just saw what Miss Sarah just very shortly, briefly introduced their company, some of the equipments they have here in the showroom. Mm -hmm. You have my contacts there, you can write in the comments. I will directly forward you to Miss Sarah so, or Simon, uh, our partner here. Huge companies, worth doing business with. Please welcome. I'm waiting for your, yeah. for your calls, for your messages, texts, and etc. And we will be really, really gladly uh, do our best service to you. Okay, welcome. So, Guys, here we are standing at the Museum of Zenith. Uh, Sarah and Simon, they urged me to visit here because they said I would be very surprised. I want to see what's going to be there. Okay, Please, this is our mineral museum. Okay, this we call Xue Lang Stone and it is Lucky Stone. So when our customer comes, they will touch it, bring good luck. Really? <laughs> really? Wait, wait, my friends. <laughs> Okay. Now Good. I will have a lot of luck. <laughs> and this is Mineral Museum. Mineral Museum. Okay, very okay. good. Wow. This museum consists of three halls. Now we come to the first one. Okay. It is showing how Earth originated. Yeah, exactly. Mm, the origin of Earth. Gosh. And this is a 3D printer, print our beautiful earth. Wow. You can see how you uh, coming from, from far away, far away, far away to Guangzhou, to China, to Shanghai. See? This is my country here. Yeah. Here it is really beautiful. Maybe wow, you amazing. Should, you should take a photo here. Yeah, later we will yeah. do it, maybe it's okay. Wow, mm -hmm. see, it's perfect. Mm -hmm. I like this. 
Yeah. Volcanic rock formation. Oh, watch out. Oh my yeah. God, I thought I'm gonna fall. <laughs> Actually, he's just showing uh, the riverbed. Mm -hmm. The sand and the river stone to show like this. Here we already have the classification of uh, igneous rocks. Ah. Ultra, ultra basic rocks, basic rocks, yeah. acid rocks, intermediate rocks. Mm, got it. Because of different uh, magma coast locations different, so we divided the rock ores into mm. intrusive rocks and uh, extrusive rocks. Intrusive, mm. got it. Yeah, basalt I see here. Yeah, gabbro, granite. Mm -hmm. And then we come this way. <coughs> This is hole number two. Okay. All of these rocks from our own mines. Mm. Because our boss, they also have three All mines from in China. China. Oh. China. Amazing. Here mm. we exhibited uh, lots of different rocks from different countries and also from uh, different places in China. These are all limestone. Mm -hmm from different uh, provinces and different country. This is very interesting. Mika, it's just like a uh, paper. <laughs> oh. Interesting, just like plastic. Oh, I understand, it's a soft one. Yeah. So these all stones are in China, right? Uh, actually, not only oh, you in said, China, you said all over country, the all yeah. over the countries, and these are really beautiful. Fed spa and courts, it's beautiful. Do you have diamonds here? Oh, actually, <laughs> yes. Really? <laughs> yeah. Are you kidding? Me? Yeah. And uh, let me show you later. Now you're seeing is a false gold. Okay. It's actually fairy, but it looks like gold. Actually, it's not. So we call it fool's gold. Fool's gold. Mm -hmm. This is calling. And these are for different industries. It's mm -hmm. a real metal. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Magnesium. It, yeah, this is for national defense. Very important. We oh, in see China, we say I see real gold. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No? Yeah, exactly. But actually, it's also come with some copper. Ah. Now you can see the king of this uh, museum. Don't tell me that this is a diamond. <laughs> this is ferrets. Ferrets. But wow. it's beautiful. These cubes are natural. Natural? These are cubes, natural. It's not by polish cutting, it's all by nature. You can see the nature mother, eyes. how beautiful. I don't believe my eyes. I don't want to touch, I don't want to yeah. make any trouble. Yeah. Amazing. And this is the uh, quartz. Mm, quartz. Uh, Russia, Russia is very famous uh -huh. in quartz, uh, quartz. supplies. Really beautiful. Yeah. <clears throat> That's crazy. I, I didn't even, <laughs> I haven't ever, ever thought that a company making crushers and etc. would have a museum. So we are a romantic company. Wow. And really Fike, I want to ask you, you perhaps already noticed the one, two, three, four, five to ten. Yeah. Do you know what does it mean? Maybe since you see the tuck comes to the course, comes to the diamond. Maybe the how hard they are, their dense oh, density. So smart, yeah. exactly. Yeah, you can see the tuck and gypsum gradually become more and more hard. Is, is the, this diamond? Indeed, and it's uh, the most degree, most degree one, most degree ten. Got it. Mm. Nice. And these are very beautiful minerals. 
These are all very interesting. Crazy. Now all you're seeing is different uh, outputs we produce. Besides the aggregates, we also produce the powder making. Yeah, you told powder, me. Powder, it is uh, from the grinding mill. Mm -hmm. And the uh, stone aggregates is from our crushers. Mm. For different kinds of raw materials, <coughs> different hard leads, density. Yeah, my dear viewers, I'm, I'm telling you, uh, you got to be really lucky visiting the <laughs> factory. Yeah. This is to show the intelligence of our good people, intelligent. And now you're seeing this as a 3D printer huh. made a 3D models. The jaw crusher, cone crusher, impact crusher, gyratory crusher, VSI, cone, cone, screen, and grandi meals for the powder making. Okay. Now you can see we have different uh, aggregates for the finest mm. modulars, different coarse and uh, fine. In China, because of uh, the strength different, we have different classifications. For example, in China, we normally choose C30, C30. But some customers, they need a C40, C35. It depends on the different so, applications. Sarah, I have a question. Uh, yeah. you, so you can, can you make a clinker and cement making production from A to Z? Uh, actually, yes, we can. Because Be I know that you, uh, mm -hmm. in China, there is also another company called yeah. Zenith. It's not your company because their logo is not red. Yours yeah. is red. Uh. They are specialized more in cement, concrete. Like I had a project once. I was in touch yeah. with them and etc. Okay. But I, I'm now a bit confused. So crushing and cement making this a to z like stuff you can also make it we or? can also make uh, for that zenith that is zenith germany uh, for making the blocks but uh, we zenith is many ex uh, specialized in the crushers and the grinding meals also for the clinker we can crush no problem crush from a to z a to z yeah. to making the cement yeah mm. got it yeah this is uh, hole number three. This is to show the minerals in our daily life in different ways and different applications. Mm. Mm -hmm. Plugs everywhere, ceramic, yeah. filters, wires. Okay, now we come to the end. <laughs> end. Well, uh, so we finish here, Sarah. Yeah, this was is really a... nice. <laughs> I would say it was really worth visiting this amazing factory. I would like to thank to Sarah. Warmly welcome. <laughs> and Simon, now he is shooting the video. Thank you guys, and I really wanna. I want to bring you a lot of want a lot of people introduce uh, to your company a lot because now with this it's really really hard to ha find a reliable company. Yeah. Uh, people always uh, because the choice is big. You have a lot of companies and whoever you ask, they say we are top, we are top, we are top. Mm. So Choose to why, why yeah why why these people can prove that they are top because I just saw everything by my own eyes. Um, Whatever I saw, that is amazing. That is that is stunning. A company that has its own showroom, ready products, everything, and even a museum, guys. This is another culture. I would say I don't have anything uh, to do with. Uh, I don't want to speak bad words or against or, or other factories, but this factory, the, the Zenith, really uh, like attracts you, attracts your attention. So you hear, you feel like you really want to do business with them about their pricing policy. I will say these guys, guys, if you want a good stuff, you need to pay a bit more. Trust me, I, it's, uh, you are a businessman, you're watching me, you know what I'm talking. If something is worth $1, $5 and $10, of course you always wanna save some money, but after that, 
the cost you're gonna do like for maintenance, for, for your nerves, for your health, the cost mo mo will be much more, trust me. You, you know what I'm talking about. Mm. Their price is a bit higher compared to others, but their quality is much higher compared to hires. Thank you for Thanks your for recognition. Watching. Thank you.